No, I just there's a, a problem. A partial fusion here of the L5. Um, I think this is a partially fused here. There's some transverse process into the sacrum. Um, common, common. No. It's not a good thing or a bad thing, but it's just uh, um, just another variable. That's it. But this side looks like it's not fused. You know, the transverse process. This one looks like it's partially fused right here on the left. So, okay. We're sitting or standing. Go mm -hmm. back there. I mean, every. No, no problem standing. I, I, I prefer to stand. Okay, that's what I mean. Sitting, I mean, I don't like to sit too much. Yeah. All right, let's uh, come on over here. Breathe out. Okay, nice and gentle. Let me check your SI joints, make sure they're moving yet. So your workout this morning, you made up, no problem with that. The uh, 200 meter lunges with 90 pounds and then 200 meter uh, farmer carry, right? Mm -hmm. Right knee up, left knee up. Okay, good. Have a seat here. What we tend to see is a lot of time when you have that um, that um, that congenital uh, partial fusion there. We tend to see that be um, generally a bit more problematic one. So, um, but we cleared that out today. So now you can go back to doing your your uh, um, oh man, I can't say. I was going to do it anyway. The high intensity uh, Olympic lifting. Now wait a minute. How do you do it? High intensity timed Olympic weightlifting, I guess. It's a mouthful right there. That is. I need you to come up with a better acronym for that. Yeah. The guy that does it all the time, you should figure it out. <laughs>